This guy flopping around in the wind. He looks like me after a hard day. Hey, look here. This is the cool bus. Looks like it's got, I don't know, like something threw up all over it. Well, the paint. It looks like someone someone dropped paint all over it. Yeah. I'd like to see the side of it. Like, so we'll see what the, it's just a school bus on the side? No, it's still got, um. It's like tie-dye. Tie-dyed. Yeah, that's what it, <laughs> but that's the cool bus. You can call them at that number. I don't know what they do. <laughs> Uh, it's uh, really windy out here today. I was, uh, I set the GoPro up to uh, do a little time lapse of the trees going back and forth. Sometimes I set up these time lapse and the battery will go dead on the GoPro before I'm done. And so I have this little battery pack here and I just uh, fastened it to it and hooked it into the uh, side of the GoPro. and. Uh, I don't go for a long time if I want to take a longer video. I've done this a couple hours right now. This is probably about all I want to do it. But uh, it's kind of one to show you. It's a, a windy day. It comes and goes. It'll it'll get less than it'll get more there. But it feels pretty nice. It's about 70 degrees out. So little weather update. We got our yeast uh, gone here, uh, put it in this uh, measuring cup, added a little bit of sugar, added some extra yeast into it. We have it about 126, 27 de degrees, and a little sugar in that water, and that'll proof the yeast. As this foams up, we know the yeast is working. Um, got my flour, I use the uh, pizza flour that we get at the store, so I'm going to add some garlic powder and we're going to be making a garlic crust. All right, our first one doesn't seem like it's rising much. Okay, we'll start the next one. Still 129.9, 130 degrees is what they're calling for. We're going to put some sugar in it and add the yeast, see what happens with this one. All right, we stirred this one up. Got a little sugar in it. I'm using a different yeast. This yeast is newer and that might be the problem. Maybe that other yeast is dead. So we're going to give this a little time to see if it'll foam up. Alright, I want you to look at this one. Look at the top of that. That means that yeast is working. It's all bubbled up. Compared to this one, hardly did nothing. So that means that other jar yeast is no good. It's dead. And this one's alive. So now we can uh, put it together and make our crust. And we're going to do a time lapse and see if we can watch the uh, uh, crust. Uh, get larger, you know, the dough, and then uh, I just did a time lapse of this uh, growing, so should be a little fun clip. 
All right, there's my dough uh, set in its bowl. We're gonna give it a, a good chance to rise, and uh, got my GoPro hooked up it, and done a time lapse of the dough rising. My dough's rise some. I thought maybe it'd rise a little bit more, but it's uh, it's rose just a little bit. Um, so, but I did a time lapse. It should be fun. We'll see how it looks. I see a bad dough arising. Well, I hope my dough rose all right. Hey, hope you enjoyed today's video. Messing around in the kitchen and uh, uh, just a little mismatch of everything. Enjoying the windy day. Uh, hey. Uh, I'm an Amazon subscriber or Amazon affiliate. Uh, if you uh, hit the uh, little link there, it takes you to Amazon. And if you're be purchasing something, just hit that link, go to it, and I'll get a little commission on it, and uh, it'll help me out. If you're not a subscriber, uh, hit the subscribe button, hit the thumbs up button, and we'll see you the next time. Mm -hmm.